It's just a philodendron gloriosum. No, it's not. Uh, magnificent. No, it's not. What is this? <laughs> philodendron. Gigantica. Gigantica. <laughs> so many big words. I'm getting it. It's philodendron. I'm getting it. It's a philodendron mine. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Keep everybody here. Thank you. Okay, I think our cart is kind of full. All right, they also make their own soil mixes. So regular soil is $2 in a gallon bag. Half soil, half succulent mix in the gallon bag is also $2. And they also have African violet mix for three. And a um, mix for a uh, carnivore mix also in a bag for five dollars or three dollars and orchid mix for five bucks. They also have a bunch of arches, worm castings, and uh, sphagnum moss. And this is for seven dollars. They have these cute concrete leaves for five dollars. Good for decorative purposes in your garden or on your house plants. And then they also sell these soy candles for $10. And they are from a uh, local, local person who makes soy candles. So they have these cute pots here. It's called Waste Pot, Want Pot. That's the name of the brand. And they have uh, a screen at the bottom of the pot for drainage. So this is Waters. Water Farms Nursery. Yeah, Pablo. AKA Cebu Blue, right? It's a different kind, but it's in the same family. Hi, welcome. Thanks. There's this beautiful, I think it's called a tiger fern, but look at the variegation. Beautiful. Yeah, no, no ruddy, ruddy. Heli, Peperonia heart leaf in the hanging basket. And then this is a jewel. Oh no, it's a, it's a type of orchid. Flowers of the orchid. All right, so I start putting my stuff on the counter for you. Okay. So water Farms in Nina, Wisconsin. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I bought I bought it last time. It's a philodendron. Gigantic. 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 It's small philodendron. The one that I've got. The leaves get big. Yeah. We had to spend the night. I came here for my birthday. And we had to spend the night. It was back. I was like, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm going to do some plant damage when I get here. But, you know, it's such a drive to get here. So I have to make it worth it, right? <laughs> yeah, we can hang out every time we come. Oh my gosh. <laughs> These bags are very light. Sprinkle so eight. Just gonna get bags. Okay. This is Randy. Yeah, you're doing it, girl. I am totally doing it. I know. I don't know. It's a little addiction. It's okay. Well, how, how's your house? <laughs> um, Do you have like a specific room for Not plants? as crazy as you think, but uh -huh. yeah. I've got, I've got a lot. Uh-huh. Oh my god, that's so crazy. Not as crazy as you think. <laughs> okay, honey. <laughs> I think I'm like... Oh, my, oh, my, my kids too. Oh, my daughter's too. My daughter's too. Yeah, one more. <laughs> how can you, Mom? It's too yeah, much. Yeah, and I have them here, so it's like... I love it though. A lot of these I'm spending time. I feel like I almost own more than I really do. Because I'm like hanging out with them. So I'll be like, oh god, you're yeah. their babies, uh, all their leaves, like a spider plant does. 
I wouldn't think that's a, a, a uh, sister of spider. Plants, like in tomorrow, so. okay. Mandarin. What do you girls like to do? Hi, Plantitos and Plantitas. This is Plantita Mrs. G, and I have my BFF, Plantita Mrs. B. <laughs> <laughs> and so we are back from Water Farms uh, Plant Nursery in Nina, Wisconsin, and we're at the hotel. So I'm going to do a quick uh, haul and show you exactly what we bought. Okay. Yeah. So, first I This have... is all hers, by the way. This is <laughs> mine. And that's hers. This, this so we take a lot of plants. <laughs> So the first plant I got is the Peperomia Cupid, right over here. And the second plant is also a Peperomia Cupid, but it is variegated. It's got this long stem, very succulent-like leaves. Succulent leaves. Mm -hmm. The next one I got is a variegated string of hearts. It's a little bit long. It's pretty. I love it. There you go. It's trailing a little bit. Right, next and I have is this beautiful Syngonium Albo. It's got the white variegation on it. I love it. It's so pretty. I can't stand it. It's so cute. The next one, if I can say this right, is a Philodendron Rentianum. Rentianum. Thank you. Or Philodendron Brandy. Oh, Philodendron Brandy. Okay. So it's just a little starter plant here. Next, I got this awesome Hoya Crinkle 8. It's called Crinkle 8 because see the little dimples on it? It's got like eight little dimples on each leaf. Keep on going. And then I got this luscious Philodendron Micans. Long trailings. So I don't want to like make a mess at the hotel, but this will extend it down. So this is going to be enough for propagation. And then I have the Hoya. Oh, there's no tag. I think this is a Yeti Eye. Mm hmm. Hoya Yeti Eye. Mm -hmm. It's trailing. Moving on, I have the Philodendron Atom. So it's like really tiny, wrinkled, ruffly leaves on this Philodendron Atom. And then this is just a little baby. Pelionia, I have. And this is the uh, Pultra. It's called Pelionia Pultra. Full pot. Then I have the Malaysian orchid. So the flowers in Malaysian orchid are just little, I think they're just little balls when they're formed. So that's that. And I bought two of those. This next one I have is another Syngonium, and this is the Syngonia chia pen. Chia pens. Chia pens. And there's new growth right there. Syngonia. And last but not least, Big Mama right over here, and I love her so much. This is, if I can say it right, the Philodendron Gigantum. Last but not least, I have this Big Mama over here. This is called the Philodendron Gigantinum. Gigantium, I think. <laughs> right. Gigantium. <laughs> but anyway, the leaves are huge on this puppy, and it's only going to get bigger with age. So um, they were nice enough to put on a little pole for me. And so I'm going to take them home. There's some new growth right over here. And that's the end of my plant haul. Okay, my portion of the plant haul. So we basically have um, twinnings. So I have a brandy as well, and I also have the orchid. Um, I got two of them as well, because I want to combine them together and make a fuller pot. I think that would be so cute. Um, I don't know the name of it, but I have one too. <laughs> I have a public calyx, but it looks like a Hawaiian public calyx because it's like purple. Look how pretty that is. Woo! It's so yes, pretty. It's beautiful. Yeah, so they start out... Has this purple color deep purple color and then it will turn into green as it matures and the leaves are very thick and you can't even i can't i can't yeah. you know much <laughs> but i can't do it <laughs> i also have a beautiful fern yeah it's so cute i love the variation 
And it's my first time seeing a pink, oh no, confetti. Uh, confetti. And I just could not resist. It's so gorgeous. Look at those leaves. Look at those leaves. Oh. Not pretty. So that's nine. And then I also got a mojito one. So this one is a green on green a model variegation. So it's like the opposite of, where's your, my syngonium elbow? Okay, where's your elbow? Okay. All right, let's go. So this is the Syngonium Confetti. No, what is this no. called? Mojito. mojito. So mojito. this is the uh, <laughs> Syngonium Mojito in comparison to an elbow. Look at the difference. Isn't that pretty? Oh, yeah. So this variegation is a green on green, and this variegation is a cream on green. Beautiful. I love it. I love it. I also got... A variegated white yeti Ooh. which is amazing i've had a pot of this before and i didn't know how to take care of hoya so i um killed all of them <laughs> but i start with a baby <laughs> and then i also have a chia pens don't mind the ugly leaf but it's the biggest one too so so sad but it's okay yeah. add that to my collection and the main event why I went to Waters <laughs> is because of, yes, it's called Epipenum Pinatum Alvo Variegata. Look at that! It's like in the family of Cebu Blue, but it also has the demonstration already. I mean, I think, but <laughs> it's beautiful. And she's mine. And it's like for me! Alright people, so this is actually, this is the end of the video. Um, this is what we did, the damage that we did at Waters Farm in Nina, Wisconsin. You can tell that the hotel room is like a quarter full of all of our plants between uh, Plantita A and myself and Plantita G. So if you'd like to see more videos like this, please like it and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching my video. Hi everyone, this is Plantita Mrs. G and I have my BFF over here and this is Plantita. No, I don't have a, I don't have a channel.